Despite its chocolatey reputation, Max Brenner on Boylston Street isn't only a spot for sweets. The bald man has his hand in the savory side of things as well, serving up lunch, brunch, and dinner that don't require a golden ticket. But it just wouldn't be a Max Brenner production if there wasn't chocolate involved. So cocoa powder is used to spice up their waffle fries, and the beer-battered onion rings are stacked in a tower with a side of dark chocolate ranch dressing. The ranch is spiced with different spices, and um, one of them is chocolate spice, and together it's a yummy, yummy dish. And the yumminess continues on the brunch menu, making a sweet start to any day. One of them is uh, chocolate, 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 chocolate pancakes, which have pancake, chocolate, pancake, chocolate, pancake, chocolate. You just climb the stairs to heaven on it. <laughs> If all that chocolate gets a bit overwhelming, you can still snack away at Max Brenner. There are mini Philly cheesesteaks served on brioche buns with a side cone of waffle fries. The so-called really cheesy, really crunchy mac and cheese is a creamy, dreamy dish served with fresh tomatoes and crispy bacon. They even have a classic thick-cut New York strip steak served with finger-linked potatoes and Max's favorite, white corn croquettes. It's crunchy outside like a croquette should be and inside it's creamy and delicious and the corn is a little sweet but the sauce is spicy and um, I want the croquette right now. The Brenner Burger is juicy and delicious, topped with Max's secret barbecue sauce, cheddar, and a Vidalia onion ring. And no burger is complete without a thick and creamy shake, especially when it's inspired by Alice in Wonderland. It says on the cup, drink me, and it has the smile of the cat, and it's connecting people to the fantasy side of chocolate. <laughs> And while candy is dandy, liquor is quicker. The Satisfaction Guaranteed Drink is a brilliantly boozy beverage served over a fishbowl full of ice, along with nuts drizzled with caramel liqueur and an extra beaker on the side for a truly intoxicating elixir. And finally, before you roll your way out the door, you can get a few more treats to go at the in-house chocolate shop packed and stacked with all things creamy, dark, and delicious. And whether you leave with a mug to hug, a syringe to shoot, or just a box of gourmet chocolates, you'll certainly never forget your first experience with the bald man.